Hey, welcome to episode six of 1031 Rules, brought to you by best1031online.com, where we discuss all things related to the powerful 1031 exchange. I am James Bean, also known as 1031 Broker James, and this episode is dedicated to rule number two of the five main rules of the delayed and partial exchange, which are the two of the most common exchanges performed. Rule number two states that you must engage a qualified intermediary or accommodator prior to the close of the property to be relinquished, also known as the downlay. This rule is crucial and probably the most important because if you take possession of the proceeds from your sale, that triggers a taxable event which ultimately voids your ability to execute a 1031 exchange. This also happens to be one of the most common reasons exchanges fail because so many transactions happen is non arm length transactions where there are no agents involved and the parties to the transaction are not aware that a qualified intermediary or QI must be involved. There are many different QIs in the market and they are not all alike nor created equal, which means you need to carefully vet the QI you are going to use. Many nuances of the exchange rules are up to interpretation and not everyone agrees to others' interpretations and that too has caused exchanges to fail. Stay tuned as we will dive much deeper into these specific nuances in later episodes of 1031 Rules. A common myth about the use of an accommodator is that they do not have to be a QI, which is true. There are attorneys, for instance, that can act as an accommodator. However, there are restrictions to a taxpayer using a professional who has previously re represented them in a financial manner, and that is that they cannot have been engaged with them within the last two years if they are going to accommodate their exchange. Your safest best bet is to use a specific qualified intermediary whose sole practice is that who accommodates exchanges on a daily basis. Please stay tuned and subscribe to this channel as we are the only 1031 exchange education channel in existence and it is our promise to dive deep to uncover and unpack all aspects of this powerful investment property tool. Be sure to hit the like button as well as subscribe and follow me at 1031 Broker James and all of your social channels. Thank you for joining us and invest wisely and remember the best 1031 is a successful 1031.